Uh, my name is Mario Lopez Palleja, the superintendent for OHL, Ariana Construction in Miami, Florida. Um, I supervise the, it's the University of Miami Ambulatory Center. We use the Betamax 3000. And the reason we got the Betamax 3000 is because the criteria for me to be able to use it was that it had to fit relatively large objects. And, and our main criteria was drywall. Drywall was 12 feet long. So when we had a 12-foot sheet of drywall, we really needed the space to be able to take it, put it inside and take it up. And that unit for us worked out great because it allowed us to carry a lot of different things. Prior to this, the majority of the work that we did to get things into the building were cranes and forklifts. Because we have a curtain wall system glass, uh, once the glass goes up, there's no opening. Uh, everything's closed. Once, once we had the roof in place, the the crane was unusable. It just could not be used for anything. So I researched the Betamax. I, when I looked it up and asked for the referral, it turned out to be it was the exact same people that we used, which was Sundell. So we we were able to just make a quick connection, call them, and have them come out and tell us what you know what we could do to, to make it all work. So it worked out real well for us. The Betamax was a whole lot easier for us. Safety-wise for us, which is a big deal, it helped us a lot to, to, to keep everything where it needed to be and the control we wanted to have. The installation was through Sunbelt, and Sunbelt was able to give us scaffolding on the interior to provide a, a, a safe platform and a deck so we could actually tie in with, with the Betamax into the building. We, it basically landed right on the edge of the slab or the deck that they created that we could safely have people walk in and out. And that kind of helped us uh, quite a bit. There was no, no problems with it. Everything worked well. But the impact was great for us and it allowed me to con continuously bring things into the building or out of the building uh, because towards the second half of the time that we used it we were taking things out of the building just as fast as we we're bringing them in so it, it actually did help a lot so it, it worked out well for me as far as keeping the job flowing and i would definitely recommend it because it was it was very easy to install and it was quick to use for us the betamax it helped us uh, tremendously. I think we had that thing running minimum 10 hours a day and it did not stop at all at any point. Whenever it went up, it went full. When it came down, it came down full. So everything was constant. It was a constant up and down in order to keep materials moving into the building, trash coming out, and people going up and down as well. Mm -hmm.